I'm gonna go over the banded shoulder warm up. So first we're gonna go with pass throughs. So we'll just start with a band. I just got a jump stretch band here. <clears throat> we're just gonna go with pass throughs, getting that band as a narrow a grip as possible as you're comfortable with. And I wanna think about pressing that band as far away from me as possible all the way around. So I'm not just simply going around in that stretch, but I wanna think about actively pressing away as far as I can. So I'm pressing up and I'm pushing back as far as I can as I make that motion. So I'll do 10 reps there and I'll go to the next part, which is the pull aparts. For the pull aparts, again, same thing, narrow as you can comfortably and just pulling the band apart, squeezing the shoulder blades in the back. You can do 10 of these, you can do five overhand and five underhand, or you can do them all one way or the other, whichever way you feel it the most. Next is gonna be the external rotation. For this one, I like to just take one piece of the band because it's a little bit harder. And I wanna think about keeping the shoulders down and back. I don't want the shoulders forward like this. I wanna keep the shoulders set down and back and then keeping the elbows pinned right by my side and externally rotating both shoulders at the same time. With all of this, I wanna think about keeping the core neutral. A lot of times we tend to, when we're doing shoulder warm up stuff, we tend to arcs in the low back. I wanna keep everything neutral, squeezing the shoulder blades together to keep the focus on the shoulder and the rotator cuff. Next is gonna be the PNF pattern. So we'll go diagonal, we'll be here, and just pulling apart in a diagonal pattern. Just like that. I like to think about this overhand position. If you're familiar with overhead squats, it's kind of that same position as the overhead squat position. So we'll do 10 of those on each side, pulling apart in that diagonal pattern on both sides. And then we'll go with a pull down. Again, starting with a narrow position overhead, reaching up, and pulling that band apart as wide as you can, focusing on using the shoulders to pull apart and reach up in that overhead position. 10 reps there. And then the last one is gonna be just a stretch and activate, so we'll be here. I wanna think about letting that band pull me as far as far back as possible, so I'll get a little bit narrower on the band, letting that band pull me into that full stretch and the biceps and the shoulder, and then pulling around in front, squeezing the pecs in the front. Every time I reach back, I wanna think about reaching back into that stretch, get a little bit more stretch every round. You can go through this sequence, 10 reps of each, go through it two or three times, Shoulders will be ready to go.